What is up, Flock? Finks here, and welcome back to another Farming Sim 19 Mod Spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods. I give you guys my thoughts and opinions, and I leave them linked down in the description down below so you too can go download them if you please. Now, I get a lot of questions uh, throughout the week. People want to know when my next Mod Spotlight is going to be. Guys, uh, you can guarantee you almost set your watch to it. I mean, every time it might be a little, sometimes it might be a little bit off, but uh, I upload these every Wednesday at noon. Uh, to the best of my ability. If there's uh, enough mods and uh, I am not super busy that week, I always, it's it's the set scheduled time. Wednesdays at noon. So, if you're sitting there thinking to yourself, when's Phoenix going to upload another mod spotlight? Wednesday at noon. All right. Let's move on. Uh, now we have we're gonna do we're gonna do trucks this week. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, six trucks to do this week. Uh, we're gonna knock those out. We've already got next week's <laughs> mods loaded in, so we're just gonna keep keep rolling on these with the new year. I'm sorry, I am I, I got like a slight heartburn. So if you hear me burp or you hear that little that's just <laughs> indigestion, man. It happens when you get older. Now, someone in the last video had said that the uh, shop trigger was right in front of me, and I just want—I want to take a second to show you guys. It's not. Uh, this is to open the shop menu, which is this. It's not the actual like edit menu or whatever. Uh, I have walked all around here. I do not see it. So uh, the person who said, "Hey, it's right in front of you," this is not. This is not an edit uh, shop thing. It is the actual just actual shop menu. So just had to, okay, wrong Ford. Just wanted to make that known. Ooh, this interior is nice. Except uh, whoever's sitting in the passenger seat, man, I hate to tell you, you're gonna fall through the floor there. Jesus, Pete, you're in for one heck of a ride, Mayor Filler. All right, we've got the goat sitting there. Oh, the goat. I love the goat. Alright. Let's go ahead and customize this. Design, none. We have flaps. Ooh, back off. Anybody else remember Tasmanian Devil? Uh, fenders. Oh, I really hate those. Fenders plus fla f flaps. None. Okay, we're going to go to none because I really hate those fenders. I don't know... I, I don't like them at all, so we're gonna go with these. Uh, engine setup we have the Pack Car MX 13 12.4, 12.9. The Cum, we're gonna go with Cummins. We're going with the Cummins, yep, 100%. Uh, and then we have the choice of color, not many options on this one. Ooh, oh, hello, baby blue. Oh, wait, 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 Heather Violet. I like. And it's too a little too much of a faded purple for me. Let's go lavender violet. Oh, that's okay. All right, get a little bit, a little bit jam violet. Ooh, ooh, ooh. like it. Okay, maybe I I just move my mouse a little bit too much there. Okay, all right, we see grape violet. Oh, I'm so spoiled with all these purples. Magenta red, eh? Wine red, not bad. But we're definitely we're gonna go we're gonna go with you know we're gonna go with jam violet I like that's my jam. <laughs> you can get jam anyway. All right. So let's go ahead and hook. Make sure it hooks up here. We'll pull around a little bit. See how how well it pulls around and everything. Do we have lights. We have lights. Do we have blinkers. We have. Blinkers. I didn't even see we had lights back here. We do. All right, and then reverse. We'd have reverse. All righty. Horn. Okay. I can I can deal with the, in the default horn. So get six two. I just left a mess from the last mod spotlight here. She gets the sixty two for sure. Ooh. Okay. I, I kind I really I do kind of like that uh the engine brake. Let's get her going again. Kind of stopped really fast, but then again, I think I Oh. I like it. 
I don't like it a lot. Let's go ahead and bust the UA here. Disconnect that. And I guess we'll park this thing. Oh, it looks like a farm down here. We'll go park it down here. And here we are. All right. All right. So this thing, I will give. I'll give it a five out of five. Uh, there's some things that uh, I've noticed, like when you. They don't stay on it. So when you turn on your first stage, I don't like I don't like how they do people do that. Just the the bulb lit up. I don't like that. It's not it's not realistic. But at least they redeem themselves in the later stages. So that's a plus. Um, the only thing I really see that really bugs me <laughs> is how you can see the ground underneath the passenger seat. Oh, it gives me flashbacks to riding in my dad's old F one fifty where the floor is rusted out. Um, <laughs> So we'll go ahead and give it a 5 out of 5. It is, it is a beautiful truck. Everything works. Uh, very minimal on options, but what you get is is good enough, in my opinion. So you don't need a ton of options. Uh, even though we have a yellow engine in here with a Cummins. Blasphemy. Moving on. Next up, we have an International international Harvester Fleet Star here. Look at that smoke. Ooh, I'm already disliking this engine sound. This is going to be interesting. Moving on. Customize. Oh. Okay. We can't take the bed off. Visor 1. Visor 2. Visor. No visor. Snorkel. Ooh. Sidestep. Okay. Let's do the side. Uh, let's do that. Actually, let's see what any other options they have. You can get all three. Ooh. And you can get. Okay. Oh my god, there's so many options here. Okay, I want it without the snorkel. Like that. We'll go with that. Base material. Okay, that turned... Okay, we'll keep that... Was that chrome? It doesn't say the colors. Oh, no. 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 Okay, we'll keep it the first one. Base material. What is all this? Okay, we'll go with purple seats. Uh, rim color. Iconic blue. Let's do... Looks a bit weird. It looks weirder. That looks good. That, look, that looks really good, actually, in my opinion. Alright. Moving on. Base material. Let's make that blank. I, I don't know. Main color. Make it red. Base material. Can we make that black? Okay, that looks a whole heck of a lot better than what we started with. <laughs> Let's customize that. Ooh, the interior is kind of lacking. All lights work. Blinkers. Oh, back blinkers don't work. Horn. Crane horns. Ooh, this thing's got a hitch on it. Let's see if it works. I can tell you one thing for certain. I'm not going to see if this thing makes it to 93. Can we hold stuff in here? No. It's just a flatbed. It doesn't even have tension belts. Okay. That smoke texture, though. Alright. This thing... I 
I'm gonna give this thing a three out of five. I'm gonna give it a three out of five. One, because I I wish you could take the bed off. Like I wish that was an option that you could just have like run it as an actual truck. I think I would like it a whole heck of a lot more and it would be bumped up to a four if that bed could be taken off because you can't even like put stuff in it. Like you can put bales and stuff in it and strap it down, but as you guys can see here, you guys can see the straps down here. So you could put bales in it and strap it down, but I don't know, I would much rather have like a grain bed or something on it. I, I don't like this, I don't like this look at all. Um, the interior is really kind of compared to other things we've seen. Even like the the modeling on the, like the lights here, it's just very simple and, and the engine sound is just god awful. So I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. Let's move on to the next one. We have an international. Another case, international. Harvester. Shema. Alright. Menu. Customize. Capacity container. Platform. <sighs> Platform support. You can't take it off of here either. <sighs> okay. Well, at least we'll do the container and see if it holds stuff. International 460, international power. Let's go international power. Main color, let's make it red. Ooh, and then design color, let's make it white. Ooh. Rim color, let's make that red as well. Ooh, customize, yes. All right. The interior is actually pretty nice. Can we hold stuff in this one? Fill unit one, fill unit two. Yeah, we can. All right. That's a step up from the last one. We have blinkers. We have side blinkers. We don't have front or back blinkers. We have light back lights. Oh, no, that's exhaust. Oh, no, no, that's suspension. We do have front lights, but they're barely noticeable. Horn. I enjoy that horn. This a green dump. Oh, this is it appears to be. Oh, baby, that dump animation. I'm torn on this one. I guess I'll give it a five out of five. I I personally don't like this truck simply because you can't. Again, you can't take the bed off of it. I would I would enjoy these trucks so much better if you could just knock the beds off of them. Um, at least this one you can run it as a grain truck. I I just I don't know. And then the lights where you can barely tell they're lit up, which I guess that makes sense because it's um, it's so old. Um, but I much I would would love to have rear blinkers on it. Um, I'll go ahead and give it a five out of five. I just I personally am not a fan. Moving on to the T six hundred. This is a truck. Oh, look at this interior. This is a truck we used a lot in what was it fifteen? I think customize. Design color, none, or design, none. Flaps, oh, we have the same, what, no. No. What's this, rack? I guess we'll do rack and flaps. Rack and flaps. I'm guessing we have the same engine options, we do. We're going with the Cummins again. Mirror options. Ooh, do we make it the jam? Oh, we'll make it another color. Marlin blue? What's that? Okay, that didn't change anything. Marlin blue? Ooh, okay, I like that blue. Let's just make that... Oh, yeah, okay. All right. All right, I see you. Oh, and then we can change the... Oh, sorry. 
my leg itched. We can make the bumper the same color. All right, I like that already. I was kind of worried that we'd have just a black bumper. This used to be Tufts Baby. Anybody else remember that back in the day? We have backup lights. We have we have light lights. We have high beams. Horn. In-game horn. I'm okay with that. Take her on a trip. And our favorite rocket ship. Get the 62. It sounds so good. It will. It's, it sounds. It sounds really good. It looks really, really good too. Let me just put it. It looks really, really good. Jesus. Just make that and take it up here. Blinkers. Alright. So this thing I'll give a five out of five. The only thing I see that I don't like is when you turn, it leans into the turn. So like if you're you're turning right, it leans right. I don't like that when it comes to mods. I like them to lean outwards like they actually do in real life. So if you make a right turn, the truck will lean to the left. Um so that's the only thing I, I see that I don't really like about it. Other than that, it's beautiful. It looks it looks extremely good. Uh, I, I, I don't have any negative thing to say about how it looks other than just how it looks when you're turning. So, moving on. Oh, oh dang. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Oh, look at that screen though. Hello. This is nice. I don't like this, but what the hell is that? Ooh. Scraping the roof here. Don't mind me. Right. Let's see what we can do this thing. Customize. Design. No rack. No rack and beacons. Headache rack. That is a short headache rack. Holy crap. Um, Headache and beacons. Toolbox. Ooh. I don't, I'm gonna go with no, none. All right, design T680 standard, paint it chrome, HD bumper. I think we're gonna go with the chrome. I like the chrome bumper on it. Deer guard, uh, yeah, I kind of don't want that. Uh, Tatcher's hidden exhaust, single exhaust, straight exhaust. Dude, I like the beefiness of that one, so we're gonna go with that one. Um, Alcoa steel rear, uh, arrow covers, uh, arrow covers too. Super singles, uh, super singles, uh, no hubs. Alcoa front hubs, Alcoa all hubs. I think that's what we're gonna go with. Yeah, we're gonna go with those. All right, we have the X15 Cummins. <gasps> Does that change inside there? We're gonna see. Let's go with that one. Arrow kit. Flow below kit. No arrow kit. Alright, bumper color. Ooh. Uh, main color. Pearl white design color. Oh no, let's make that. Make that black. Um. We'll do like 
Ah, that's too plastic key. That's too plastic key. There we go. We'll go with that. Customize. Yes. Do some Ravens colors. Hopefully they won because I'm recording this on Sunday. Yes, it does change it. Sweet baby Jesus. We have blinkers. We have blinkers. We have reverse lights. Hold on, let's see. Break, reverse. This is going to look jank. I don't care. Okay, see that? I like, I kind of like that. Wait, hold on. Okay, no. I was about to say, does the TV light up in the back? All the buttons light up. That's pretty. That's pretty cool. Get seventy-five. We'll drop that off there. Slid right in there. It was this change. Open crane. Okay, that does that. What does this do? I don't know what up and down does. Does it do something in here? No. Oh wait! It opens the door! Okay. pretty awesome all right this one's gonna get a five out of five if you guys couldn't figure that one out uh, this is a beautiful truck everything works I don't have any complaints whatsoever on it it's a beautiful truck yeah I mean this is again from whiskey Sierra modding and dude I'm telling you this stuff's on point his stuff is freaking on point if I can get him to do a t-800 <sighs> Although I think it's going to be kind of hard to beat the T800 that came out, but oh dang, this is nice. All right, and last but not least, we have the Western Star. Oh, look at those legs. Oh, that was kind of pixelated, but it still looks nice. All right, let's see what we can do this thing. Menu, accessories, none. Antennas. Visor. Visor and antennas. You know, let's do both. Let's go both. Fenders, none. Ooh, now those are the fenders I like. Paint it. Yeah, let's go with the painted ones. Uh, what engine setups do we have? Same engine setups as the other ones. Chicken lights. Yes. Wait. None. Side. Yeah, now we gotta have all. Yeah, we have to have all. We have to have all. We gotta, we gotta be seen from Mars. Okay, that's the only options we got. Main color, candy apple. <sighs> Ooh, I even like that second color. We're keeping it. Yep. Not even, not even mad. Oh, well, the lights. I like. Blinkers. Oh, yes. Still in reverse, Terry. We got no backup lights, so that kind of stinks. Check out this interior. Ooh. Dang. Yeah, no, that's nice. That's real nice. Look at that smoke, man. I love it. Getting the 57. All right. They all look. Oh yeah. Dang. All right. Work zone ahead. This is a dirt road. Just so you know. All right. 
feel like oh my hold on maybe let's 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 get her up to speed and then just let it cruise and see what this Jake break sounds like before we 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 throw our rating out there Here we go. Ooh. Alright. Alright. It's definitely going to get a 5 out of 5. I really like it. It looks really, really good. I have no complaints on the way it looks whatsoever. 5 out of 5. Freaking awesome. And that's going to do it for today's Mod Spotlight, guys. If you guys didn't like today's Mod Spotlight, be sure to leave a like down below. It does help me out so very, very much, and I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future Mod Spotlights, be sure to click that subscribe button. If you guys want to be notified whenever I do go live or upload a video, be sure to click that notification bell. And as always, guys, thank you so very, very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!